This is Bezerak Pottery. We'll be with you in just a moment. Hey, welcome everybody. This is John at Deseret Pottery, welcoming you to our weekly uh, Zoom meeting here. Um, today we are going to be going over quite a few things, little things. Um, so uh, let's get this show started. Let me see. Do, 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 do. Start my video here. Okay, not sure if everybody can see me yet. I'm not moving. So let me change over, stop sharing here. Okay, so this is our, oh, we've been doing this for about a, a month ish, ish, ish. Sorry, I gotta change my thing here so I can see myself. But I can also see our agenda here. So, uh, been quite an interesting uh, last two weeks. Uh, last week we did not hold our Zoom meeting because uh, I was actually out of town on a vacation. Uh, we had planned the vacation back in January for March, then COVID hit, so we were not able to take the vacation back then. We uh, postponed it till September, but we had to change it to beginning of October. So anyways, we are back here in Phoenix um, and kind of is interesting. I had ordered this uh, new potter's wheel um, about uh, a couple weeks ago and they told me that, oh, it's not gonna be, you wouldn't receive it until after I was planning on getting back well, wouldn't you know it came the same day as I was leaving, but it came after I had already left. I had left like eight o'clock in the morning and it came sometime in the afternoon or evening. Uh, so my entire time up in Chicago, I kept on thinking about the potter's wheel that I can't even see. Uh, shout out to my brother-in-law, Kelton, who uh, made sure it got picked up. Uh, it is kind of weird. We had put a stop on it. They're supposed to pick it up from the from the UP. Um, I'm sorry, uh, yeah, UPS uh, location. But even though we put a stop on it, they delivered it anyways. So then he had to rush back home to my house to pick it up, move it inside. Plus, there was a couple other things that he had to go to Michael's, which was a, a, a destination uh, where he could pick it up at. Uh, the, the what do you call it uh, the stool so we now have a uh, we now have the uh, I can't find I can't even think what I'm talking about uh, we now have the this is oh, there we go be wonderful but there we go so this is the potter's wheel that i have here um so i got home late night like 10 30 11 o'clock on set this past saturday um and i had a sunday afternoon uh class that was scheduled uh, so here i am i did not go to church, which is 
very unusual for me. I love to go to church. Um, and so I put this whole thing together, it took me a while. Um, and uh, it, um, the, the appointment time was one o'clock and about one twenty five, one twenty four, something like that. The uh, student contacted me, they had to cancel. Uh, so I did all this, and got it ready. And to be honest with you, even to this day, that was on Sunday that I put this together. Today is now Wednesday. I still have yet to actually use this wheel myself. Um, right here, uh, I'm not sure if you can see in the back here, there's a little hole. It's a, a drain hole. Um, unfortunately, I can't point at this. This is just within. Uh, uh, anyways, we'll come back to that. It is closed. Okay, so uh, very nice wheel. Uh, and actually, I had a student or couple. Actually, I've had two couples since then. Um, and the first couple, I, I had two wheels set up and everything, and I still forgot that I had two wheels and I was working them off of one wheel. And then last night I got one person to start on one wheel. And I says, so I told the other guy, I says, okay, now you can go on this wheel. He was actually sitting at it. So um, let us go back here to the screen share. Uh, I want to stay on. Uh, Did not, here we go. So, um, okay, I want to stay on, on task here. So, the uh, here the new wheel is up and running. Uh, class hours have been cut. What that means is that um, uh, now that we have two wheels uh, for uh, our students, we've been basically for especially couples, which is what we get most of. We are um, have been giving them four hours now. That's a, a long time, even for couples. Uh, but now that we have two wheels, uh, what we've done is we're going to we've cut that down to two hours, and that allows for uh, plenty of time to be on the wheel because uh, in two hours I can do I can still do a half an hour of uh, and a half an hour demo and instruction uh, segment, and then still each person still gets an hour or more on the the individual wheel. So uh, that has been a uh, a good thing. Um, the next thing here on here is the uh, Groupon price is increasing. Uh, we have had so much uh, response to our Groupon ad. Um, and actually, what I didn't put here, uh, the Groupon has increased, but we've actually temporarily uh, paused the, the old Groupon so that I can create a new Groupon uh, form here. Um, the the reason we're increasing the price is it's still going to be cheaper or less expensive. I should say not cheaper, but less expensive than our website price. But we want to try to maximize our profits. Um, I'm, it seems it used to be 50% or 51% of our students were coming from Groupon. Now it seems people found Groupon. So we're getting more like, I, I haven't run the numbers, but it seems a lot more like 70 or even 80% of our students are coming through Groupon, uh, which is great. Um, they still will save money. Uh, and that's what people like. They, people like to save money, but uh, we're doing a lot of work here. So want to try to increase the uh, the rate for a couple of reasons. Uh, 
so that we can buy more equipment. Uh, also, um, for other plans that we have, which I'll, I'll get to here uh, in a little, uh, a little bit. So the next thing is a new veterans group is coming soon. Um, let me get back here, stop sharing. Uh, so we were contacted by this organization that does fun things for all kinds of people, I guess, but they have a, a special group of veterans that they want to, to uh, have a, a, an activity or something. Uh, so I've been actually contact, uh, speaking with this lady who's the, uh, the coordinator for this organization. And um, it's really, I hope I, I, I explained to this lady that we are a small studio, you know, an in-home studio. Uh, so I have to kind of limit it to uh, six people at a time at, at the most. I don't really want too many people uh, it'd be very crowded. Uh, I can accommodate up to six people. I know this because I've already done it. Um, and what we would do in this particular scenario, uh, we only have two wheels. Um, so we would either just bring in two people at a time, uh, which would be like six hours or we could do a four hour session um, and people would rotate uh, because we have two wheels, four hours. Um, we could kind of rotate the people through. So we'd have one person on the wheel, uh, two people uh, per wheel, one person on each wheel, and then two people kind of what we call a coach. I actually learned this from another artist. This is how she teaches. And the coaches, after after the uh, demonstration and everything, the coaches will help the person who's on the wheel um, to you know remember the different tasks and all that, which will help myself um, because I'll be bopping back and forth. But the coaches will also they'll be by trying to remember you know when you have more than one brain together, you can remember things. And so then they, they can swap out. Um, so kind of exciting, kind of scary. You know, it's like, wow, things are growing. People are finding us. So I'm really actually very grateful. So let's go to the next item here. Um, oh, OK, uh, instructors needed. So this is another reason why I need to kind of start raising my rates. Um, I am uh, looking for instructors. I actually put a, uh, a job posting on an art uh, website uh, here in Arizona. Um, and I want to be able to offer to the people, you know, a decent rate. Um, I would say up to 50% of whatever my take is, or yeah, I haven't quite figured that all out. Uh, so if you know of anybody who has the skills uh, and can teach, uh, please send them to me. I did not put this here. Uh, let me go over, stop sharing. I have to uh, do, 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 one participant, which is me, uh, or so chat screen. So, do, do. I should have had this up already. So what this is going to be to everybody, you can just uh, send them to support at, I can't write, D-E-S-E-R-T, DeseretRockPottery.com. And if they uh, send a message to me there, um, I will respond. Uh, it's been so busy that sometimes I don't get to it right away, especially if an email comes in when I'm not, uh, when I'm teaching a class or something. So uh, moving on, let's get back over here to share screen. Um, so 
I, I right here, moving to LLC. I am looking at getting incorporated. Uh, this is part of our plan to get into a commercial space. Um, we want to get into a commercial space because we are growing and uh, we've already kind of outgrown our space right now. So uh, uh, I'm looking at, and hopefully maybe within this next week or so, I will uh, have, you know, it started to uh, get incorporated. I will, once I get incorporated, then I can open up uh, bank accounts in the company's name. Uh, I will, I already have a CPA. I probably need to get a bookkeeper and what else? Uh, oh, and I will, well, especially once I get into a commercial space, I will have to have commercial liability insurance and uh, whatever goes with that. So um, that was there. Um, that's that's what I'm trying to do with the, the business end of what we do here. Um, and I will, of course, broadcast it here on when appropriate on the the. Uh, the Zoom meeting uh, will also post it in our blog, so that way uh, we can uh, get the information out. The last thing is uh, is the future of Zoom meetings. Um, I, I was thinking about this this morning. It's kind of late in doing it, but I'd like to actually do PowerPoint presentations. Um, and the reason for that is I think it'll just look a lot more clean, a lot more professional. And I like to look uh, very professional at all times. So you can tell my head is in outer space. <laughs> it's because I want to look professional. I'm actually looking at getting a, a background image here uh, of my, my studio. Because uh, right now I'm actually not in the studio. I'm actually in my living room. And you may hear some birds chirping. I have uh, two love birds. And they just want to talk over me. But sometimes I have a little trouble getting good a good connection with the Wi-Fi. So this is the best alternative is to be in here. So, um, yeah. So we want to get the, uh, the PowerPoint. A uh, lot of things that are going on. Uh, there's nobody else in here other than myself right now, so I can't really have a question and answer. Uh, well, one thing I didn't put, speaking of questions and answers, I have updated the site to include a FAQ page. Uh, so if you go to desertrockpottery.com uh, forward slash FAQs, uh, or you can just click uh, from Desert Rock Pottery up or up in the menu bar at the top on the right hand side is for our FAQs and you can see the most common questions I, I've been getting. Uh, I've always found it kind of difficult to anticipate what people think but um, or what people want to know but these are the questions that I've been presented with mostly. So if you have any questions though of course you can send us a question either to uh, support at desertrockpottery.com or from our website, you can go to our contact us page and send us a message there. Uh, so that's about all I have for today. We did this one in very good time, 19 minutes, 20 minutes or in a minute. Um, so that is all I have for us today. Uh, keep on practicing. If you have any questions, give us a contact. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.